Several dignitaries who include the governor of Edo State, Mr. Godwin Obaseki, former governor of the state, Chief Loki Nusaha Igbinadion, managing director and top management staff of Share Company Limited, members of the Maritime Association, captains of industries, legislators, family members and friends from within and outside the country, converged on Edo Hotel Market to celebrate a result-oriented advocate for the advancement of Nigerians' maritime sector, engineer Greg Utome Ugbenfu at 71. In a remark that Chief host and managing director, Stars Investment Limited, Ms. Iogama Ogbefun, said the event was organized to celebrate an achiever, engineer Greg Ogbefun, who has impacted positively on individuals, industries, and government. A perfectionist to a fault, a forever optimist, an achiever, a hard worker. Dr. Adeyeyo Jo, who is one of the masters of marine, unveiled the Greg Ogbefun Maritime Technology at the Edo State Polytechnic Hussein to equip youth with technical skills in the country. He said the industry is not only about classroom experience, but will assist students with practical knowledge. A former managing director of the Nigerian Port Authority, Chief Bayo Babatude Sarumi, supported by the Chief Lancha and a former governor of Edo State, Chief Loki Nusaha Igbinadion, Edo State Governor. Governor Mr. Godwin Obaseki and others unveiled the 24 chapter book written by the celebrant titled Not Always Easy My Vogue from Obscurity that tells everything about the celebrant. <laughs> The chief launcher and former governor of Edo State, Chief Loki Nusaha Igbinadion, said the endowment fund for the Greg Ogbefun Maritime Institute of Technology, Edo State Polytechnic Hussein, will impact positively on the institute. Whatever is collected tonight and beyond is for the endowment of the institute in the Polytechnic Edo Center. Edo State Governor Mr. Gordon Obaseki said the celebrant Egina Greg Ogbefun has recorded remarkable success in business and expressed satisfaction with his contribution to the growth and development of Edo State. He said the establishment of the Greg Ogbefun Maritime Institute of Technology at Edo State Polytechnic Hussein is commendable. We want to thank uh, Engineer Greg Ogbefun for the initiative, for the support, for bringing the maritime industry to come and support the initiative. At the school. Some guests, including the rector, Edo State Polytechnic Hussein, Professor Abiyodun Faludun, Senator representing Edo South Senatorial District, Matthew Rohide, Executive Director, ITV and Radio, Lady Celerina Ojomo, said the establishment of the Maritime Institute of Technology, Edo State Polytechnic Hussein, is laudable. We actually want to uh, express our gratitude to His Excellency Mr. Godwin Nogagaso Baseki. For this laudable and great initiative, the Greg Ubefu Institute of Maritime Technology will be offering vocational skills in the maritime industry, in the areas of uh, warehouse uh, operations and management, in the area of shipping operations, in the area of fleets to logistics operations, and terminal operations. Beyond that, there's got to be a kind of joint skill acquisition certification where we we'll partner with international agencies in the maritime industry, such as the International Maritime Organization, IMO, which means that all our students that will pass through the Greg Ogbefu Institute of Maritime Technology will be fully certified, both at the national level and international level. Pray that God grant him speed, grant him the enablement to do that which he still has to do for our people. Him contributing to the academy and to the growth of children is a wonderful thing. We thank God for it. The celebrant who personally appreciated all the dignitaries and guests for identifying with him said at 71, he's determined to use the rest of his life to impact humanity, hence the establishment of the Greg Ogbefun Maritime Institute Technology at Doste Polytechnic Hussein, why some of his family members also congratulated him. My role is to continue to encourage them, continue to let them know that there is hope, even in a situation that looks hopeless as we have in the country. For the endowment, he loves doing what he likes doing. He's a philanthropist. And I pray that God should bless him financially to do more. I just thank God for his life. I'm so proud of him. Engineer Greg Ogbenfo was also unveiled as the face of Port Business, Radio Nigeria Port Harcourt, just as he cut his birthday cake and took to the dance floor. Best Mbire reporting.